that was a defensive lapse from Serbia, just allowing Sammy to go coast to coast and get some points on the board. Or Lace comes up with the steal. Back-to-back -back layups now for the Opals. It's nice to see her get an opportunity to see the ball go through the basket. And you think about that over and over because that could have been the ticket to Paris. Yeah, they missed by one point that free throw at the end um, from Ratsa. But then again, you can't, yeah, it does give a, a player that hasn't shot the ball well a sense of relaxation, at least off of a layup and say, oh, okay, I could still make it. You know, as going to the Olympics is on the line right now. So for her to already have 12 points in this half is just amazing. Izzy Borlace drills the three there. So their fate is not relied on the, Germany again, uh, the game against Germany or Brazil. So she knows what she needs to do. The coach and Long three. She thought the shot clock was winding down as she heard her bench holler at her. That's a great look by Izzy Borlace. Put it on a silver platter. To continue okay. the pace that they're on right now. They're only down three. Serbia at this point. Brazilian crowd now booing the Australians. And the reason behind that is if Serbia wins this game, Brazil will have an easier path. It's Beck Allen inside Mabagor. Borlace for three. Indeed, a cold-blooded three and by Izzy Borlace.